It was an incident of racial violence. In January of 1923, January 1st, it began. It was a week of tension, a week of violence, a week of death. January 1st, a white woman in Rosewood, a small community about nine miles east of Cedar Key in Levy County, claimed that she was beaten and assaulted by a black man. That led to a group of white men to go in search of the alleged victim or the alleged um, its perpetrator. And that will result by the end of that first week in January in the destruction of a small African-American community. It was destroyed. The descendants of Rosewood, they had lived with this story <clears throat> for many, many years, actually for many decades. And when the mother, I guess we could call her the matriarch of the descendants passed, her son decided it was finally time to do something about this. And Holland and Knight provided pro bono work for, for the family. Um, Martha Barnett and Steve Hanlon will represent the descendants of the Rosewood families, making a claim against the state of Florida that the state of Florida did not protect them uh, in their rights. Uh, as citizens, they lost a lot. I mean, lives were lost, but also they lost land um, and they lost legacies that would have been passed down from one generation to another. 